All right, let's take a look at the Akinetics Vulnerability Scanner. All right, now, Akinetics Web Application Security, they do have a free edition out there, which is what we're utilizing. All you have to do is go to their website, akinetics.com, sign up, and they will shoot you a link with the download and a serial number as well once you register with them. Pretty straightforward in regards to uh, getting the product, installation, and now we get to see how we actually utilize it. Alright, looks like there's a new build available. Patches and updates are also available. Alright. Alright, so here is our Akinetics Web Vulnerability Scanner. And this is going to be more specifically for web application security testing. So what we can do here is we have our tools available that we can utilize. We have some web services we can use, configuration settings we can change, and then we also have some general such as pro, uh, program updates and so forth, licensing and all that fun stuff. Also user manuals available that you can utilize as well. So what we can do is we can actually run a new scan. So what I'm going to do is run a new scan. Now what's really nice with, with this is they have their own testing websites that you can check out. So let's check it out. We're going to go ahead and run a scan type, such as scan a single website. You can also, if you save the structure using the site crawler tool, you can then save the results there and then do it against the crawled results. You can also scan a list of websites as well, and then you add it in from a file. You can also scan a range of computers uh, as well, which will also inspect the HTTP and HTTPS. Website. So what we're going to do, to, however, is we're going to try out. They have three different sites you can utilize. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at these. So let's go to the testphpvoneweb.com. It's going to go through and get us some information. So right now it's done some banner grabbing. And it's telling us that it's running Apache 2.0.55 Ubuntu. Unix operating system, Apache 2.x, detected uh, 404 error pages. Nope. Also gives us some additional information here in regards to optimizing the technology and so forth. So let's go ahead and click next. Now crawling options. We're going to go ahead and just leave it at the defaults here and let's see what it comes up with. Our scan options we can just use the default but we have different options available that we could utilize as you can see here. You can use the Google Hacking database and so forth and kind of take it from there look at cross-site scripting and all that good fun stuff so let's go ahead and just stay at the default here for the current we also have different scanning modes quick heuristic extensive and let's see what we got here we have login information if we have any kind of login sequences and in our case we don't so we're just gonna go ahead and hit click finish and let's run it Alright, now it's in action. So as you can see here, it's come back up with some nice information. Pretty colorful. Greens are always good, right? Reds are not so good. So here we have currently one or more high security type vulnerabilities discovered. Looks like it's getting there. In regards to information that's finding pretty good. Now this may take a long time as you can see here we're only at 1.59% so we've really have a while to go before this thing completes. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pause it on my end and take it through and then we'll look at the end results. Alright it finally finished up after 49 minutes and 45 seconds and let's see what we have on our as our finished results. It ended up finding 46 high alert threat levels, 27 medium and 9 low, and 72 informational. Now, what we should be able to do is just click on the report here, and this will load the reporter up for Akinetics. Now, one thing I wanted to mention here, the free edition charts out the website and identifies cross-site scripting vulnerabilities only. Just keep that in mind as you're using the free edition. Get the full edition. Uh, again, you pay the high dollars and you get yourself a very nice start division. As you can send, 
it says here, right, in the free edition, the reporter can only generate reports for scans performed against Ekinetics test websites. The reporter will start just to show you the reporting capabilities when using the full version. Again, important, as I just mentioned, in regards to the free edition. So you can kind of see we have 94 pages here that we can look at. And you actually only get to see this during the testing of the Ekinetics test websites, which, again, there's three of them out there. And you can kind of see, uh, again, the information in greater detail. And also, if you're using this against real clients, then you have to buy the full version. So again, you can kind of take that through and try it out. This will give you a nice little test drive using the product. Do a little searching out there. This particular product, the full version, is the number one out there when it comes to your web application testing online. So it's, it's the best of the best out there. So definitely uh, you could check it out.